skincare is something we take very mm -hmm. seriously over here at GMA3, especially when it comes to our eyes. Yeah, you see me in the hallways with my eye patches every morning. <laughs> I'm guilty, but lucky for us, ABC News contributor Roxy Diaz is here with an essential guide to eye care. You guys know I'm all about my anti-aging tips and tricks, and thanks to our sponsor, Rock Skin Care, I got a one-on-one -on -one lesson on how to treat our most popular eye area concerns from board-certified celebrity dermatologist, Dr. Sheila Farhang. In the morning, for me, it's all about cleansing, applying your type of vitamin C, and then your SPF, an eye cream there, both for the upper and lower eyelids in the morning and in the evening. I feel like I do all those things, but I must be doing something wrong. So what should I change in my skincare routine to actually see it working and be effective? You know, I talk to my patients a lot about this. It's all about keeping it simple and consistent. And it takes time to see these results from our skincare routine, but it really does. It's a marathon, not a sprint, is what I tell patients. So today we're really focusing on the eye area. I'm just now getting into skincare around the eye, but what I have yet to understand is why does it have to be different from the rest of my face? Great question. The skin around our eye is actually 10 times thinner than our face, which is why we see the signs of aging appear faster there. It's also why we need to treat it differently and use products specifically made for the eye area. Some of the most common eye area concerns are dryness. So how would we address that? So of course, hydration both inside and out using products and hydrating and drinking water. And also adding a humidifier is something I recommend, especially if you live in a dry climate. The dreaded puffiness around your eyes that can age you so much. How do you deal with puffiness? So decreasing salt intake, sleeping on a few pillows, this will help drain a lot of that extra fluid around the eyes. And my tip that I love telling my patients is using a cool compress or one of those cool facial tools just to help the lymphatic flow and drain a lot of that fluid out. And last but not least, those dreaded fine lines and the dark circles that make you look so much older than you really are, what can help with this? Oh yeah, so decreasing that screen time, of course, getting adequate sleep, and using a cream, which I'll get into, but using your ring finger when you do this to avoid pulling, tugging, and traumatizing the eye. There's a new product that I absolutely love that addresses all those concerns we talked about, and it's Rock's new Dual Eye Cream. It was developed in partnership with dermatologists and plastic surgeons. This new clinically proven two-in-one eye treatment is for the upper and the lower eye area. The upper eye gel visibly lifts, and the lower eye cream visibly smooths, depuffs, and reduces dark circles, which is so great. This formula, together with unique peptide and retinol combinations, delivers clinically proven results for the eye area. In fact, 90% saw visibly lifted eyelids and reduce lines and darkness in just two weeks. Best of all, it's super affordable. You can find it at Walmart for less than $30. Thank you so much for these tips. I know everyone is going to benefit from them. Of course. Thanks so much to Dr. Farhang and our sponsor, Rock Skin Care. So here's the question. Who's switching up their eye skin care routine now? You are always looking for the okay. tips. Yeah, yeah, you are yeah. always looking for the tips, Roxy. And I'm following your advice. This is the skincare queen expert in the building. I just follow my mom's advice. <laughs> we all follow mama's <laughs> advice. <laughs> Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.